if you believe in the public service function of journalism to inform the public, the public is pretty well informed right now. The public has the option of being well informed they if they to want be. to be. They right. choose exactly. to be. Right. Yes. They choose to be. There right. are plenty of places now to go and get information. What worries me, and I think probably you, is, is that there are also ways of going to our own corners right. and only going to Confirmation places. Confirmation bias. Where, exactly. They tell right. us affirmation, not information, right? right? They tell us how we're right about things. And that's where, obviously, there's some worry. And the credibility of brands is important in a moment like that because people are also often uh, promoting facts that are not really facts. Right. right? We understand the fake news environment that mm -hmm. we hear a lot about is in part because uh, uh, news brands that are not credible are existing side by side with brands right. like the New York Times. Which you hope, especially younger uh, right. readers and younger voters who are just starting out in the world basically and they're getting everything from Twitter and Facebook and all these other places, is that when they see information, it's not all equal. Right. That they shouldn't just assume that the fact that this is on Twitter and that is on Twitter means these are uh, the same. They're Don't not. believe everything you read. The right. old adage turns out to be true.